morning weather. And welcome back, everyone. Well, it looks like we are taking a break from the oppressive summer heat. Today is cool and cloudy. These cool and cloudy conditions will persist for the remainder of the afternoon. Very overcast on that Tioga Sky Camp. And as you head out there, you may want to walk with an umbrella. Showers are in the forecast for the afternoon. Right now, our temperatures are generally ranging from the upper 60s to the lower 70s across the 20th, 72 in Mansfield, 68 in, Ty in Penyan, 69 in Ithaca, and yes, 79 down at Tawanda. So it is cloudy overhead, and as you can see, those showers are beginning to work their way into our region from the west as we have that wave of low pressure that is causing a lot of active weather across the Midwest. All this rain will move into our area this afternoon. So again, as you head out there, definitely walk with an umbrella, maybe a rain boost, because we are going to end the day on a rainy note. So cloudy and rainy for the remainder of the afternoon, light to moderate rain. There will be pockets of heavy rain, particularly during the latter part of the afternoon. Temperature-wise, we are going to remain on the cool side with our temperatures in the 70s and 60s. Now let's look at that future track. Cloudy for the remainder of the afternoon. Those showers will impact our area into much of the afternoon. There will be some pockets of heavy rain as those showers impact our region. And then there is a chance that some of these showers could contain gusty winds, particularly for those of you in the northern tier of Pennsylvania. But the heavy rain will quickly move out of our area this evening, leaving behind mostly cloudy skies with a few lingering showers. Wednesday will be a drier day, a mix of sun and clouds. Temperatures will top out in the upper 70s for your Wednesday, so we are going to remain on the cool side tomorrow. In terms of the rainfall totals, lighter totals for the Finger Lakes region, heavier totals for those of you in the northern tier, there is a potential for over an inch of rain in parts of the northern tier. Now we continue to track Tropical Storm Debbie, which is pounding the southeast coast with a lot of rain. Debbie has winds of 40 miles per hour. Right now, over land, we expect Debbie to move over the warm waters tonight into tomorrow, possibly restrengthened into a strong tropical storm or category one hurricane. Eventually, the center of circulation will work its way into the northeast, bringing a lot of tropical moisture our way. So there is the potential for some heavy rain later on this week. This is one model, the GFS model. It brings about two inches of rain across our region. And then the European model is a bit more bullish, brings over two inches of rain across much of the Elmira area. So here is a look at the seven days, 77 for a high today, remaining on the cool side for tomorrow, and then heavy rain later on in the week. All right, thank you, Deshaun. A tornado ripped the roof off of a nursing home in Buffalo, New York.